Hey guys, Crown Jewel 602 coming to you guys today with a favorite of 2016 and I have been absolutely, I'm like, I'm so excited to give you guys this video because I have absolutely been loving everything that is on this table to show you guys. So let's just get started. First product I'm going to show you guys is the Aztec Secret um, Indian Healing Clay. I got this off of eBay for like six or seven bucks and it's actually a powder. And I didn't know that until I purchased it. But the directions say mix it with apple cider vinegar or water. I've done both. I like them both. I prefer water because it's just quick and easy under the sink. So you make a little clay paste in your hand or in a dish, however you prefer. And then you put it on your face and you let it dry for like 15 minutes. And it just deep cleanses your face. This is a great, great product. It's organic. I'm doing more organic stuff. Absolutely love that. Next thing I'm going to show you guys is something like I just lucked upon this and it has been a godsend. My Clarisonic broke. I mean, it was an original Clarisonic, but it was purchased from Ulta for like $199 whenever they came out and it broke. And I guess you say like, I don't know, two and a half years or so, it's okay for it to break. But I have like curling irons that I've had since forever ago so I guess it just goes to show I'm getting old and they don't make stuff like they used to so I had to find something that was like a tool to clean my face to get it squeaky clean and I was at Burlington Coat Factory and they had this sonic facial cleanser here's the box it's by um Rucci R-U-C-C-I and here's what it looks like and I thought oh that looks like that trio trio thing I've seen it and it's like $199. So here's this one. It's pink. It's got these bristles on the top. And then you turn it around and it's sort of got these bristles. It does have two um, AA, AAA batteries that go into here. And it is waterproof. There's a dial on it that you can do like a two speeds, a plus plus. And then you turn it on this way. And it vibrates. And you just sort of hold it in the palm of your hand and clean your face. This thing get, is $12.99 and it gets my face squeaky clean. I can't imagine what the $199 one should do. Now I have compared them in Ulta like I'm sort of a creep. I'm taking stuff in Ulta and comparing. But um, I will say that the Trio, I think it's called, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, that one's bristles are a lot longer than this one but this is $12.99 and when I tell you that it cleans my face like so great. Two thumbs up four thumbs up if I have a palette that somehow made it into the rotation that I've been using so much is the BH party girl palette um, I don't use necessarily all the colors in here but I do like this one and then sort of this pink one's gonna hit pan soon um, these bronze shades here I love and then this row of greens do the the best green smoky wonderful goodness eye so um, this one's like 12 bucks or something like that at BH Cosmetics, you can catch it on sale. Maybe you'll get it for six or so. It's amazing. I have been on a highlighter kick. Um, and I don't even know what I'm wearing. Oh, I w it's in this video. And it's not a highlight. But I'm wearing it as a highlight. But the two that I have been loving are the NYX Liquid Illuminator. This is in Sun Goddess. This is the new shade. They released the darkest one. And I absolutely love it. I've already swatched it, actually. It's right here. And it's just a nice bronzy and it's a sun goddess the way this wears on me is that the actual coloring on it is not a highlight the shimmer is the coloring is a little deeper and it reminds me of like being on a greek aisle and getting out of the water it's fantastic this one is the revlon skin light which i'm late to the party and it's bronze light and i swatched that one too and it's right here and it's just a really great Look at that beautiful highlight and it blends into my skin tone really well so that's also a reason why i love it um what i've been wearing on my face it's really dry is the elf tinted moisturizer in espresso love this product however i realized the elf is not stocking their darker shades so once this one is gone it's probably gone which makes me sad because it's just one other makeup company not selling products to us brown skin girls and I really do love e.l.f., so that seems blasphemous, but if you guys haven't tried the e.l.f. Tinted Moisturizer and you're like Mocha or lighter in e.l.f., no, Mocha's not there. Whatever's lighter than Mocha, maybe Almond, um, try it because they're catering to the lighter skin. We're not going to go there. So, um, 
The next thing that I'm going to mention is this Sinful Colors. Sinful Colors are in Walmart and Walgreens. And um, $1.99 or $2.99 for this gel coat. I've been using it on my nails to sort of make my nails last. My nails will last a full seven days on this, which is unheard of for actual just nail varnish. So been loving that. And just try it out. It's $2.99. Like, it might make all your nail polishes last forever. And that's what it's been doing for me. Um, another product I'm going to show you guys is something that I had screenshotted from my makeup group for like six months. Finally found it. And it is the NYX Blush in Sun Goddess. That is, no, in Beach Bay. There it is. And that is what I'm actually wearing on my, oh, there it goes right there. I absolutely love it. It's like a pinky shimmery. It's what I have on my face right now as like my blush and highlight. And it's great. Obviously, it looks really flattering. And I love it. What drew me to it is because my absolute, if you guys have been following my channel, know that my absolute favorite highlighter in life is the NYX Blush and Pecan, which is that there. But they are not dead on dupes. The um, Beach Babe is more pink. And that one, as you can see, is just more gold. So, but been loving that. Completely worth it. I'm not a big, huge fan of the new blush packaging, but whatever. Brushes, I've been loving. I got this dupe for $236. $236, guys, it is an It Cosmetics dupe, and it is, like, dead on. I took it into the store. They're dead on. The people at Ulta were like, what? $236 on eBay. Love it. And it is great for packing on powder. And setting your makeup. I haven't been doing much of that because it's winter and I'm dry now, but it is great for that. Um, some more eBay dupes are the Bold Metal Collection of Real Techniques on there. And I love almost all of them. I got this, these five, so six or seven total um, for $7. These two are eyeshadow brushes, fluffy and domed. Love those. Contour, blush, and highlight. And as you can see, I've been using them. I wish that the camera would show exactly how soft they are, but can't show that through the camera, so whatever. Oils, face oils. I have been a person that's acne prone. I always thought oils were ill for your face. Like, that seems weird. But I got so dry that desperate times called for desperate measures. So I originally purchased this L'Oreal Age Perfect Glow Renewal oil and it's fantastic i love it it hasn't broke me out or anything face oils are great they're formulated specifically for the face so they're wonderful it has a little dropper on it and um it looks gold in the tube so that's just kind of more appealing and then i also looked upon this olay regenerous facial oil it's a daily treatment this one's clear the dropper is a little different you get the same i believe the same amount of product but this one does smell like orange peels um, and it's a little bit lighter than the other one. So I use this one in the morning and that one at night. Giving me that glow. You see it. Face is clear from Proactive. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you guys is something that I just purchased today. Repurchased because my daughter broke it. And it is what I set my face with. It's what I set my under eye with. And it is the, um, Black Radiance Soft Focus in Creamy Bronze Finish. It is a huge, huge pan. And it is only $6.94. Like um, you won't have to purchase one for a long time unless yours ends up looking like this. I tried to reformulate it, whatever. Um, but my daughter broke it. So there's that. Something else that I just... Ha I, I only got one. I did this big order from ColourPop. It only got one eyeshadow. The eyeshadow that I got um, was Game Time. It was a metallic shadow. It's what I'm wearing on my eyes now. And I'm going to swatch it for you guys because it is... These ColourPop shadows are everything that you see on YouTube. Like, look at that color. Like, look at it on my lid. It's completely gorgeous. It can be underneath. It could be a topper. It could just be patted on your finger um, for a center, you know, glow. But I want to say six bucks or five bucks. Five bucks on ColourPop.com. ColourPop Cosmetics. It's great. Look at it. Oh, my God. And the best way to apply these that I found is literally just putting your ring finger in it and tapping it onto your eye, which is what I did today. Looks fantastic. Um, I've just been loving ColourPop. Like I said, I did a huge order. And 
What I have on my lips, just to show you guys, is Chili Chill and then this one, which I believe is either Beeper or Tool. But I mix those two together. And that's what's on my lips right now. Um, the two, the one that it just surprised me that I absolutely have been loving is Kapow. And it is like nothing that I have in my collection. It's like a deep gray plum lavender. And it, it gives you this dead look, but it's like a cute dead look. I can't explain it. If you guys follow me on Instagram, Crown Jewel 602, you can see some pictures of it on my brown skin and it's fantastic. The next one is a lippy stick and these smell so good, guys. And that's in grunge. And there's it right there. And it's just a 90s nude. It's like a berry. Love it. Comfortable on the lips. Matte. All the ones that I got were matte and they came out with the satins. So I might reorder and get some satins. Um, this one is just fantastic. I looked up on this when I went downtown Cincinnati uh, last weekend. And I have been loving it. Worn it a million times. And it is the NYX lingerie um nude lippy in beauty mark yeah the one thing that i will say is this one is a super dry formula like it's the most drying and i've got some ebay ones that are really dry um so i suggest using a lip balm with it or else you're gonna have crusty lips and they're gonna crack and you're gonna cry and you're never gonna want to wear a lip liquid lipstick again um next thing i'm going to show you guys i have to show you a brush and then a couple other products and that's it this is the elf ultimate blending brush if it looks weird it's because i re-glued it and shortened it sort of because i like it like that but this oh is what i use when i say every single day every single day maybe sometimes with the beauty blender but my, but every single day this it's six dollars it's wonderful i love it it's just great. It's better than sort of any other Sigma one that you're going to find out there. Setting spray is this, the new Wet n' Wild, uh, what is it called? Photo Focus setting spray. It's really, really tiny, so you only get 1.5 flu fluid ounces of product, which isn't very much for a setting spray, um, and, but it's $4.99, and if you catch it, buy one, get one, or 40% off, or 50% off, or whatever it is, um, you can sort of stock up, which I have on like five of these. I love it. Some people don't. I've seen negative reviews in my groups, but I love it. Last product I'm going to show you guys is something that completely surprised me, and it's a Wet n Wild gel liner. It is actually a cult favorite of a lot of people's um, on YouTube, but I just now tried it, and it's the gel liner in black. Yeah, black. And it's black and it's great and it probably rivals a lot of high ends it is easy to apply and once it sets it's there it's wonderful it's dense and it's beautiful absolutely great and completely worth it and I want to say it's $2.99 or $3.99 wherever wet and wild is sold so that is it <coughs> excuse me if I talked really fast but this video is already 13 minutes so I'm gonna get off here until next time guys stay beautiful peace YouTube